Well, tomorrow is Veterans Day, a day to pay tribute to all Americans, living or deceased, who served our country. It's also a day to highlight and raise awareness about a problem far too many veterans face. Our Everett Casimir shows us how one local vet is working to reach out and to help. So while we acknowledge Veterans Day one day every single year, some veterans are living every single day with a serious challenge. And one local man is doing what he can to help other veterans like him cope. I still get panic attacks and uh, I will occasionally have some depression. William Krieger lives every day with PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorder. He refers to it as just PTS to remove the stigma of disorder from the condition. The veteran served 10 years in the Navy and did one combat tour in Iraq. His PTS is still a struggle. The PTS never really leaves. Uh, and for me, the severity never really goes away, but it's managing those symptoms that's so important. So important, it could be the difference between life and death. Before Krieger learned to manage his symptoms, he tried to take his own life. I was at the end of my rope, in all honesty. Um, I was having panic attacks. I didn't know what was going on. I was snapping at people. Uh, I didn't like myself. And it culminated to this point where um, I was just tired. My kids were out in the backyard and my wife was out shopping and it was a beautiful sunny day and I decided I just didn't want to be here. But then his phone rang, a call from a friend that for some reason he chose to answer. That friend asked how he was doing. It was then he knew he needed to get help. Through that phone call, I uh, went to a counselor, an amazing counselor who I still see on a regular basis who really helped walk me through what I was feeling. If I feel as though a panic attack is coming on or I'm having some symptoms, I may breathe in and as I'm breathing in, I'll count to five and then I'll hold that breath for five and then I'll breathe out for a count of five. Krieger now works to help other veterans through their post-traumatic stress as well. I work for a company that uh, hires a lot of veterans. So they have created a position called the Veterans Affairs Program Manager. Helping others going through what he has has helped him in many ways. It feels amazing. The person I'm talking to a lot of times thinks that they're the only person that has ever felt the way that they feel. That includes his own veteran son. That's the beauty of the two of us being veterans is not only is he my son, uh, but he's also my friend. And when he is struggling, he will call me. Krieger had this to say to any veteran who's struggling this Veterans Day or any day. Reach out. It's okay to not be okay and to raise your hand and say, I need some help. Krieger doesn't just help veterans on the job. He actually started a podcast. It's called You, Me, Us, where they talk about how to manage symptoms and a whole lot more. We posted a link to his podcast on our website. Just go to clickondetroit.com. In Detroit, Everod Casimir, Local 4. Wow, and in honor of Veterans Day, businesses all over town have special offers for veterans tomorrow. You can find a link to our complete list of those on the homepage at clickondetroit.com.